Greetings, amazing minds! Ready to embark on another journey to English mastery with Snopey English? Let's learn, grow, and conquer together. Hit it! Today, we are going to learn bank expressions about deposits and withdrawals. The first key expression is, I'd like to make a deposit into my checking account. This sentence is used when a customer initiates a transaction to add funds to their account. The second key expression is, I have $1,000 in cash and a check for $500. This sentence is used when a customer specifies the amount and form of their deposit. The third key expression is, How long will it take for the check to clear? This sentence is used when a customer inquires about the time frame for check clearance. The fourth key expression is, is there a limit on how much I can take out? This sentence is used when a customer asks about withdrawal limits from their account. I'd like to make a deposit into my checking account. Sure. How much would you like to deposit today? I have $1,000 in cash and a check for $500. All right. Please endorse the check on the back, and I'll process these for you. How long will it take for the check to clear? Checks usually take about two business days to clear. I also need to withdraw some cash. Is there a limit on how much I can take out? You can withdraw up to $500 per day from the ATM or more inside the branch. Okay, I'll withdraw $300 now. Can you assist me with that? Of course, I'll just need your ID for verification. Listen to the following main sentences repeatedly and become familiar with them. Let's listen to the conversation between the two people. I'd like to make a deposit into my checking account. I'd like to make a deposit into my checking account. Listen again with subtitles. I'd like to make a deposit into my checking account. I'd like to make a deposit into my checking account. Listen carefully without subtitles. I'd like to make a deposit into my checking account. Okay, let's listen to the next conversation. I have $1,000 in cash and a check for $500. I have $1,000 in cash and a check for $500. Listen again with subtitles. I have $1,000 in cash and a check for $500. I have $1,000 in cash and a check for $500. Listen carefully without subtitles. I have $1,000 in cash and a check for $500. Okay, let's listen to the next conversation. How long will it take for the check to clear? How long will it take for the check to clear? Listen again with subtitles. How long will it take for the check to clear? How long will it take for the check to clear? Listen carefully without subtitles. How long will it take for the check to clear? Okay, let's listen to the next conversation. I also need to withdraw some cash. Is there a limit on how much I can take out? I also need to withdraw some cash. Is there a limit on how much I can take out? Listen again with subtitles. I also need to withdraw some cash. Is there a limit on how much I can take out? I also need to withdraw some cash. Is there a limit on how much I can take out? Listen carefully without subtitles. I also need to withdraw some cash. Is there a limit on how much I can take out? We've looked at the key expressions so far. 
Let's remember the key sentences and listen to the entire dialogue repeatedly. I'd like to make a deposit into my checking account. Sure. How much would you like to deposit today? I have $1,000 in cash and a check for $500. All right. Please endorse the check on the back, and I'll process these for you. How long will it take for the check to clear? Checks usually take about two business days to clear. I also need to withdraw some cash. Is there a limit on how much I can take out? You can withdraw up to $500 per day from the ATM or more inside the branch. Okay, I'll withdraw $300 now. Can you assist me with that? Of course, I'll just need your ID for verification. Was today's study useful? Don't forget to subscribe, hit the like button, and share. Goodbye everyone and see you next time.